This is the newest and second release of the Linux Lite 7 series. Based on Ubuntu 2.4.0.4.1 LTS and a 6.8.0 Linux kernel. As the name implies, this distro designed to be lightweight. In other words, it doesn't require much system resources to run effectively compared to Windows 11. Here is the comparison of the minimum requirement for both operating system. This OS is designed especially for those migrating from Windows. You'll find a stable release that will ease your transition and make it smoother and fun. What does Linux Lite offer? This distro ships with XFCE 4.18 as the default desktop environment. Materia window theme and papyrus icon theme. If you don't like the default theme and icon, then feel free to adjust it to your preference using Light Theme Manager. Linux Lite features categories of software such as graphics software like GIMP, internet browsers like Chrome, multimedia tools like VLC, and a full LibreOffice package. That's not all, here's the cool part. Linux Lite now has an AI support. This is new feature is to assist users with system-related queries. Users can input questions like how to install a theme and receive accurate and reliable response. Linux Lite comes packed with a lot of system tools, such as a system restore utility tool, which helps you roll back your device in case of a system failure. It includes a firewall for your protection, an on-screen keyboard, a USB image writer, and formatter. As I said earlier, this OS is for those transitioning from Windows this feature is more profitable for those transitioning from Windows as it makes system troubleshooting easier. Some other cool features. If you're wondering whether or not this OS will support your aging hardware, you can check the hardware database. I'm sure your device is listed there. Link is in the description below. On the other hand, you could just go ahead and run a live boot using Ventoe tool and see if your hardware supports it. You could also consider adding your hardware to the Linux hardware database to help other users. As the database feature is new, so the list of supported devices is limited. Linux Lite comes pre-installed with a report tool known as the Lite System Report Tool. Navigate to Settings under Menu. This tool provides feedback on issues users might be facing. This helps the support team more accurately tackle any problems and provide adequate and prompt solutions. Linux Lite also comes with pre-installed with graphics drivers as well as support for legacy drivers for both NVIDIA and AMD. It recommends you stick with the pre-installed video driver as it is the most reliable and the safest choice. If you must install the proprietary drivers, which is required if you play a lot of Steam games, all you have to do is to go to Menu, Setting Install Drivers. Wait for the process to scan your computer. After scanning is finished, a dialog box pops up. Select the option which says Proprietary, Tested, and apply the changes. Enter your password to continue. Now wait for it to download and install. Restart your PC after process is done. Linux Lite also supports dual monitors. If you got two monitors, you can get them acting as one large area, allowing you to spread your workout separately on each. If you want to configure it, head over the website. There's a walkthrough for that. There are other aspects, let us visualize them one after another. Limitations. No supports for AMD GPU proprietary drivers. Useful tip. It is highly recommended that you turn off Secure Boot in Other to have a more enjoyable experience. For installation, use Etcher Tool or Ventoe Tool to create a bootable USB drive. Lastly, the live session allows you to save your work before shutting it down. How cool is that? That's it for now. Ensure you try it out for yourself and see the cool stuff. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy the video. See you in my next video.